Hey everybody, it's uh, Sunday, uh, May 24th, and I'm home, and uh, I'm hanging out with Hannah, and we thought we'd do the vlog today. Um, the trip home was quite exciting. Uh, I left uh, Bradford, England. Uh, there's some pictures up on Facebook of uh, uh, me and the boys having some fun, uh, and some of the people we entertained. And uh, I uh, stayed out till probably 2 o'clock in the morning, uh, got back to the hotel, and uh, packed, and uh, well, said in the last ball was three o'clock morning. Got in the car and I drove. Um, I was driving at uh, four o'clock in the morning. Yeah, four o'clock in the morning. I started driving, and boy, Hannah, there was nobody in the road. It was really easy to drive. Uh, got to um, the airport. There was a small problem though. There's three terminals at Manchester, and my ticket didn't say which terminal I was going to. So there I was in a huge panic, driving through each one of the airports. Uh, phoned Laurie at home and asked her if she could check on the internet. Uh, uh, she was having trouble finding uh, even the flight, let alone uh, which terminal it was at. I uh, drove in and out of each one of the parkades uh, looking at the um, uh, rental car drop-offs because I had to find a Euro car, uh, which is also some other, it's not Hertz, it's um, national car rental. And of course I didn't find it at Terminal 1, didn't find it at uh, Terminal 3 or 2. I uh, went around the second time and in Terminal 1 I found it uh, just as I uh, pulled onto the roof of the parkade. Uh, text came through uh, from Lori saying she found Terminal 1. Uh, so, wow, we found it all at once. Of course, now I was late. By the time I dropped off the car and slugged my luggage and found the um, gate, or not gate, the desk uh, for uh, Lufthansa, uh, it was now uh, about an hour from my flight. Uh, and you're supposed to check in two hours in advance. But uh, bless my heart, I've got that uh, gold elite whatever. And uh, they allowed me to uh, check in. I uh, did my bags, but couldn't find a seat for me for the trip from uh, the final destination. See, I flew from um, Manchester uh, to Frankfurt, uh, Frankfurt to Seattle, Washington, the Seattle, Washington home, but they couldn't find uh, the Seattle, Washington flight bill. Uh, they did check it according to my bag, uh, my bags, they checked them according to my flight ticket, uh, but they had no record of the flight. Um, flew, first flight, I, f I slept the whole time. I barely made it to the gate. It was like six minutes before the flight was leaving, but I made it. That was great. Then from there, I went to uh, uh, Frankfurt, uh, bought uh, two pound, not two pounds, uh, two and a half euro a bottle uh, for two bottles of water. That's like five euro. You know what that is in Canadian, Hannah? What? Like a million dollars. What? Yeah. And then, uh, oh, I went up to the lounge. I got myself some bananas because I've been told by friends that bananas are good for me. So I ate a couple of bananas, lots of potassium. Oh, and then it came exciting. I came back. I parked myself in front of the gate, and uh, they weren't loading. And it seemed weird because I thought I was there just in time. I checked my watch a couple of times, kept looking. And then I leaned over and read the board, and I was at a flight going to Atlanta. Uh, they'd switch gates on me. Uh, and, of course, didn't announce it one more time after they switched the first time. So there I was uh, freaking out because uh, I almost missed the flight. When I did make it to the right gate, uh, I was the third to last person getting on the plane. Oh, but it gets better. I put in my uh, boarding pass, they scan it, and out popped a little tag saying I've been upgraded to business class for the 10 hour and 20 minute flight. I uh, walked on all proud that I was getting upgraded to business class. I showed it to the flight attendant. As I was showing it to him, I, I looked at the ticket again and went, that's not my name on the upgrade. Uh, it uh, did something wrong. And yep, I went back to the back of the bus, uh, 42K, way at the back where there was a guy named Thomas. He was a doctor in, uh, of agriculture, and he was out to Seattle. Very nice man. Uh, I slept for most of the flight. I was awake long enough to watch the movie Twilight, uh, which was okay. Uh, oh, and one episode of BBC's Robin Hood, which I downloaded uh, using that uh, torrent. I guess it's legal since we don't have it in our own country anyways. Uh, the Robin Hood series is great. Uh, Thomas was very nice. The rest of the time I slept, the only time I woke up is when Thomas poked me uh, to wake me up and said, it's time to eat, magic guy. And I ate. Thomas is a very nice guy, super cool. He has two sons, three and six years old, and uh, he's in uh, Seattle for a conference on um, agricultural science. Uh, made to Seattle um, and uh, uh, spent the next uh, hour with a customs officer. Uh, very nice guy, though, and he understood I was in a hurry, And uh, but they saw to do their job, which they did, and everything was cool. Uh, when I did make it to the plane, I was three minutes before the flight, and uh, yes, they had my name in their system put me on a flight and uh, oh it was great there was nobody sitting next to me so I fell asleep and uh, somebody actually took a picture of me asleep uh, and they emailed me so I'll, I'll put it up there because uh, they recognized me thought it was funny that I was uh, sleeping uh, when I did wake up on the plane line the first thing they said was wow uh, you had quite a long trip and 
They were right. I came off the plane, and uh, none of my luggage was there. Magic! It was all gone. Uh, they said it would be on the next flight, and they'd deliver it right away. Of course, this is uh, Sunday. It's in the uh, morning, about uh, 9.30 in the morning, and the luggage still isn't here. Uh, and they had since 3 o'clock yesterday. Uh, so we'll see if my luggage ever appears. Uh, magic! Uh, what was great was getting off the plane. Who did I see? Who did I see? Me. That's right. And you jumped over the big railing. Well, I dragged you over the big railing. <laughs> gave you a huge hug. Sorry, Mom. Went and had a Tim Hortons coffee and a muffin. Uh, a, a fruit berry explosion muffin. Very tasty and very healthy. And then uh, the drive home, I uh, sat in the back with Hannah and let Lori drive because... Uh, uh, boy, you know, they drive on the other side of the road here. It's going to be very confusing. <laughs> and then what did we do for the whole day? Uh, I vegetated on the couch. Oh, we went for a walk, went for a walk, uh -huh. went for a long walk, didn't we? Uh -huh. We walked so far, my calves began to shake. Uh, I'd been awake for a very long time, and uh, um, uh, we walked uphill. Hannah even needed to take a break. We walked so far. Uh, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, took a break. And then uh, after our long walk, we came back, and I vegetated on the couch. And we had a... Chuck, Chuck Fest. Fest. <laughs> it was the best. What's Chuck? Uh, it's a cool TV show. Yeah, with a super spy who used to work at Bymore, but he doesn't work there anymore. Yeah. And, and there's a, a cool girl. Her name is Yvonne. She's, uh, what's Sarah. her what's her character's Sarah. name? So, uh, Sarah. Sarah. Her actress name, her real name is mm -hmm. Yvonne, but her, her uh, character's name is Sarah. Mm -hmm. And Sarah and Chuck are in love. How nice is that? And uh, <coughs> there's the guy who looks like, what do they call him? Police. Yeah, policeman face. Policeman face. That was funny. Dude. And uh, we watched every episode that Hannah and I have missed over the last uh, two months. And uh, we watched them one right after the other, after the other. It was exciting, wasn't it? It's the end of the season. It was the end of the season. Now and we have to wait till next year to find out what's going to happen. And he learned karate on the last On the last episode. On the last three minutes of the episode. Yeah. He got flashed with the intersect, right? Yeah, a new intersect. A new intersect that, that his dad that, put together. Yeah. And this wow. time it if makes... you guys watched Chuck and haven't seen the last episode, I'm sorry, because we're basically tipping everything. But it was a really fun night, and uh, uh, we're big Chuck fans, so it was fun to watch, and uh, it ended a great evening. Uh, mm -hmm. and Hannah and I went to bed just about the same time, as a matter of fact. That uh, was a surprise. Because <laughs> yeah, I, you know, usually like, but I could barely keep my eyes open. And that was our day. Uh, today we're going to go bike shopping. And, bike, bike, uh, bike. Uh, then go bike riding, and it'll be a glorious day, because uh, it's a Sunday. And it's beautiful here, not a cloud in the sky. It's just totally blue. And uh, We're going to have to hold the back of the seat. Hold the back of the seat? I still need training. Oh, yeah. I haven't practiced Hannah for a while. Hannah hasn't uh, uh, <laughs> totally learned how to ride a bike. But you know, I have a friend, her name's Renee, and she only learned to ride a bike this year. Uh, she's old. And she's, there's a video I'll show you on YouTube of Renee learning to ride a bike. Her boyfriend showed her. Gabe, it was very cool. But... Uh, um, it is never too late to learn to ride a bike, mm -hmm. and uh, you're getting better at it. The training wheels things there off, and it's time for you to actually, uh, you know, start falling over a lot. I don't so we'll like buy you a nice expensive bike helmet. I don't like no, going down the hill. No, down the hill's not good. <laughs> well, that's our wonderful blog for today. Uh, yeah. It's great to be home, and thanks for watching. And we'll talk to you guys very soon. Um, next few days, just straighten up around the house. Uh, the uh, uh, jobs of a professional magician. Fix the things that fell apart while you've been gone and uh, uh, clean up my office. Uh, lots of paperwork, lots of contracts, lots of uh, magazines to read and uh, uh, lots of time. Uh, Hannah time. Boo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> Hannah time. Squeezing time. We'll talk to you soon. You guys keep busy. Um, uh, keep well. Keep working. Uh, but most of all, be happy. Talk to you soon. Bye. Bye.